my name is Rhapsody and welcome back to Slay the Spire. That uh, last episode surely happened. That definitely happened. That's about all I'm going to say on that matter. Uh, Anchor studies come with a 10 block, alright. Alright. There is a very risky opening path here with three elites. One of them being the Emerald Elite. If I can find an aggressive card in this shop... Well, no, I'll consider it. Pretty good draws there. Really good draws. Hell yeah, perfect draws throughout the entire fight. Lovely. Copy your Predator. Now I see accuracy. I just had the shivs off it, and now I see accuracy. After I turn away from that build because of how badly it's treated me recently. I see how it is, game. I see how it is. Again, pretty much perfect draws in this fight so far. Okay. Don't need any of those. Oh. Alright, I'm going to avoid the first elite here so that I can get an upgrade. Fruit and fruit juice and a regen potion as well. Both huge pickups there. Upgrade the Predator with five extra damage so that I can start just kicking through elites. And this is going pretty well so far. Time to see the elite who'll stop it. Okay. Really good opening draw. Sets me up for the ability to kill that frontliner with only two strikes in the next hand. That does it. I mean... Yeah, this is going really well. Oh. But when's it gonna stop? That's always my question. This is going too well. What's about to go wrong? I ask it primarily here because I've had a couple of runs recently that were off to ridiculous, incredible, amazing starts and then died. I'm still kind of recovering. Me another bone. If your HP is at or below 50% at the end of combat, heal for 12 HP. Grand finale. Alright, I got it this early. Let's try. Vajra start each combat with one strength. I do like that. Need to cut one card from the deck and then just slightly less than 50% of the chance, 50% of the time, I'll have a good thing. I'm going to see if I can get a one card draw here. We can't, that's unfortunate, but Bouncing Flask is still pretty good. As far as pickups in this situation go. I'd love to have played the Predator there, but I really do think that just hard playing all of those defenses was the best idea. And... Looks like we're going to get out of this one relatively healthy. Alright. Unceasing top. Whenever you have no cards in hand during your turn, draw a card. Well, now we know what we build around, right? I just cut cards from my deck until I can play the grand finale, right? Pretty much any card that has a cost need to be removed. Create a card in our deck or upgrade a card and get a special relic. Uh, no, we'll just upgrade a single card. Get that neutralize. Okay. 
be really nice to just get an unceasing top deck off here. With a grand finale in it. I mean, sounds good. So I'm putting zero cost cards in the deck just to pad it out. So that we can occasionally draw an extra card. Like here, I get to draw one extra card this turn. Unfortunately, it makes no difference because I couldn't draw one extra card the turn after as well in order to get Grand Finale active, but yeah. You can see the general direction in which we're going. Obviously can't put on playable cards in this deck. Makes absolutely no sense to do. We have very little aggression in this entire deck right now. Like, we are very much relying on this build going off suddenly. Ow. I mean, if I don't play the Predator there, I'm just never going to deal enough damage to this enemy, so... <clears throat> kind of obliged. Eight damage out of the enemy's Quiver for that turn. And we'll basically just be keeping them weakened for the rest of the time off of the back of that weakness potion and neutralize following it so we might be able to get through this boss But it was a little bit dicey there for a moment. And now I actually get to play the grand finale next turn. How fitting that we only get to play it that turn. I'm doing it. I don't care. Runic Pyramid. At the end of your turn, you normally discard your hand. Yeah. Look, I'm almost certainly going to die here, but... For a brief, shining moment, it looks like we have the ability to possibly get a Grand Finale deck to actually work. So I'm going to need some variable draw in this deck. How do I make my, sure that my empty, my, my draw pile is empty without redrawing? If I try and draw and my hand is full, it just goes to the discard pile. So if I keep trying to draw, it'll shuffle, right? test that theory. It's only three cards in my draw pile. Nope, it just draws those three and stops. Grand finale, grand finale. <laughs> now we just cut cards. Oh my god. This is so good. <laughs> My God. So if I cut a card from my deck, how do I how does that help me? If I cut a card, I can keep more cards in my hand at the end of my turn. Is that is that the case? 
So I'll have two on the bottom of the deck. It means that if I can cut three cards, I can go off on turn two is the thing. Which we should just do, right? Yes. No, 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 no. Putting apparitions in the deck is bad. Uh, Jax is also bad for us. We'll just take the mutagens. I think it's time to just upgrade our grand finales. They're going to be all of our damage. Cut one more card from the deck. <clears throat> Only need one more removal at this rate. Come on. We only need one more removal, but any enemy that trashes our deck is awful for us. Calipers at the start of your turn lose 15 block rather than all of it. Yeah, okay. I should also basically upgrade every defensive card. Do you have to? But do you have to do this? If I play anything this turn, I don't get to Grand Finale next turn. I have to play things. One, two, three. Now we're fine. Grand Finale number one. those should just hit the straight up defense there okay I need to make space for six cards in my hand so I do that then that that if we get Predator in the opening hand, we have this sorted a lot of the time as well. Nolly. That doesn't mean I put another Predator in the deck, by the way. Does Escape Plan go in this deck? Because Escape Plan is variable draw, right? You can use it, or you can not use it. <laughs> no. No. Couldn't be a card removal option. Definitely rest here. I'll tell you what, this is going to be an interesting fight, if nothing else. Grand finale, grand finale. I have to make sure that I get back those grand finales. Right, now I have three spaces in hand. Or rather, I have to make three spaces in hand. Attack, attack. Great. Grand finales next turn. My God. Oh, this is dirty. <laughs> Doesn't matter how many cards I try and draw here, so I can use those. I'm not weakened next turn either, so just double grand finale kills. <laughs> uh, Curse and Key is actually a problem for us. Puts a curse in our deck. We don't need the extra energy. Not really. Uh, I'll take Lizard Tail. When you would die, I healed to 50% of your max HP instead. Works once. It'll save me from a mistake. Uh, yeah, we don't really need the extra draw. Sorry, we do need to negate 
uh, negative impacts on our draw. Uh, so I'll take this. If I get gold enough, like to get us to 150, I'll go to here and remove, and then we're just gonna go ham. So I need six spaces in hand again. All right. Oh no! No! Repulsa! Sucks. Stupid Repulsa. Four spaces in hand here. That'll do it. His daze burns out. No! Repulsa! Again! You got me again! How did... Uh... I've got to remember, I need to be more mindful around deck trashing effects with this build. money I was looking for, by the way. Ah. Ah. My god. Yo. I have to. I have to. Then I... <sighs> there's no way... There's... I actually can't talk. I'm too excited. there that asked me to make a grand finale deck. I did it. Oh, I'd love to be able to remove him. I just avoided the elite. That's fine. The deck trashing effects in the heart fight mean that this was not really a viable heart thing. Uh, those daggers are going to put wounds in my deck as well. Got to make space for seven cards in my hand. Because right, that goes into my discard pile, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, wound goes to my discard pile, so now it's grand finale, grand finale, grand finale. It's the singing ball. When any cards you attack, you may raise your max HP by two instead. It's just... Uh... Just up there. Not the right cards. I needed to make space for seven cards in my hand. Gotta keep that in mind. Grand finale. Then just get down to the five. Space for four cards in hand. So one, two, three, four.
I can't really hold Grand Finales, right? No, not really. I don't need to take that damage. Smoke one. Hand graph at the start of boss combat seal for 25 HP. We've already decided we're not going for the the heart. Sure. Weakness applied to everyone on turn one. Begin to fall, I get to remove a card from my deck. Nice. If the next space is another removal, I'm going to be really pleased about it. Unfortunately, I had to remove zero cost, though. Damn it, that's not a removal. Space for six cards in my hand. I'll do it. Those go into my discard pile rather than my deck. So one, two, three. Ice cream! Energy is now conserved between turns. That is actually relevant for us. Dono and Decker. Those do go into our discard pile as well. So the first shuffle, we're going to be able to get this off as well. Which is nice to see. If I want to use all three this shuffle, I don't get to play another card this turn. But I'm going to have difficulty from here on out because of those days. That sucks. Grand finale, grand finale, grand finale. Draw seven, and then five in the hand thereafter. So I need to have five spaces in hand here. One, two. I need seven spaces in hand, so. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. Right? Don't play any more cards. And then we win next turn. A grand finale! A grand finale! Now that is what I call a speed run. Easy Ascension 8 victory right there. Nothing but three grand finales and a predator and two deflects in the deck. For the moment, my name has been Rhapsody. I really like it. It was quite good. I'm very proud of that one. Uh, if you do like the videos, by the way, please click like. It does help me get my content out to new people. And if you aren't subscribed to the channel but want to see more content like this, consider subscribing. My name has been Rhapsody. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves and hopefully we'll see you next time.